objective has been lost. Let me help you. What's up ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a brand new video. Today I have a guide with a V car. It is a marksman, it's the last marksman rifle you will luck. And in my opinion, it's one of the worst guns in the game. It gets better uh, the more attachments you unlock. I figured some of the best attachments to use for it. Um, I tested a bunch of stuff and the attachments that I'll show in a second are probably the best for it. Uh, but still it is up along uh, one of the worst guns in the game at the moment It's pretty much equal to a pistol with a little bit more bullets and a little bit more range. That's how I would uh, Say it is um, But it definitely became a little bit better the more I used it So the way you want to play with this gun is you don't want to go for long distance kills at all uh, because it simply takes too many bullets and you kind of want to be up close. You will be outgunned by uh, some machine guns. The only good part with this gun is once you start unlocking extended mag and you go on flanks, you can actually kill a bunch of players because you get around, I think, 41 bullets and it can take up to three shots uh, if you're close enough. So you can kill a bunch of players uh, with one mag um, and you want to be kind of in the close distance range. Also, the hip fire is kind of good. You can actually outgun players with the hip fire. Uh, but other than that, I didn't really enjoy using the gun that much. Uh, I want to share the attachments as, as I think these attachments are probably the best uh, for this gun. Um, so let's get right into it. For the side, I used the Fusion Hollow. I also enjoyed using the uh, XRD Hollow, uh, which was pretty good. So I would definitely like try this one out as well. And then I sometimes use the two times scope. I have the Raven four times, but I didn't really use it. I was trying it out in the very end, um, but you don't really want to kill players across the range where the Raven four times becomes useful. So I was using the TV two times, the Fusion Hollow most of the time. Uh, pretty much 90% and then I tried a little bit with the XDR Hollow as well, which was pretty good as well. Uh, you want to have the close combat drum mag because you get 41 bullets and it becomes a lot better. Um, I have the, um, which I think the close combat extended uh, rounds um, as backup and then like the overall extended mag as another backup in case I run out of bullets. Uh, but the drum mag is definitely something you want to use. Then for the grip, I used uh, the BCG light grip, uh, increases the accuracy while moving. I was doing a lot of strafing with this gun. You don't really want to be standing still because um, you're going to be in those close range situations. So you want to keep it moving this way. You can at least uh, have a higher chance of winning gunfights. Um, so the BCG light grip was uh, the one I used. I also sometimes use the uh, laser size, but not that much. And then for the barrel, this is a must. You want to use the extended barrel. Unless your trigger finger is very good, you're going to like the close uh, or the shortened barrel. Uh, this will increase the rate of fire. Um, but I would 100% re recommend using the extended barrel. The gun actually becomes useful for mid range um, and the damage uh, increases a lot more across range. Um, so. Uh, it becomes actually a lot more consistent. I noticed I was hitting a lot more shots across range because it increases projectile velocity. Uh, so extended barrel, definitely recommend. Um, it's almost a must have, I would say. Um, 
finally unlocking the extended barrel and the drum mag increased the gun a lot like before that it was a pure pain to use this weapon but unlocking the drum mag and the extended barrel made the gun a lot better then i have the 6ku suppressor as a backup you know in case you go on those flanks uh, you kind of want to be using the suppressor and then i was trying out the aircom tactical muscle break which which was uh, pretty good but eventually i was just using the extended barrel and the silencer uh, so these are the attachments i uh, use um, so yeah as i recommend stay up close within your enemies uh, but don't really play too aggressive because you're going to be losing a lot of gunfights uh, you, you won't win from submachine, submachine guns and assault rifles, so you kind of have to play more smart. But the gun is extremely good for uh, flanking and getting on high kill streaks because it has so much ammunition. Uh, so you can see it as like a, um, a pistol that is like upgraded a ton. Um, so yeah, I don't know if I would really recommend trying out this weapon, but if you need the best attachments, these are the ones I recommend. Uh, so I actually do have some clips with the gun uh, from the live stream. Hope you guys enjoy. Be sure to subscribe for more guides and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Oh my god, dude. I got that so often where I just like... Pretty much stop shooting. Like the trigger finger just, I don't know, doesn't want to shoot as fast anymore. There we go. It's like my finger is overheating, you know, that's kind of... <laughs> Best way I can explain it. Good kills right now. Let's go. Huge. How on earth am I alive right now? What? That was sick. <laughs> no way. Oh, I got revived as well. Thank you. Just to top it off with the luck I'm getting this uh, round. Keep it going, dude. Ah, oh, center gun. Okay. Oh my god, I actually made it off. Heal, please. <laughs> I'm, as a, I'm alive, dude. Oh yes, console service dude. <laughs> this is actually what I need dude. <laughs> That's the sentry. It's me always hoping a real player will actually know but... Hello. 
<laughs> Little bit of effort, but we got him. Three players on the objective. Sentries and dogs are here. What's up ladies and gentlemen, quick reminder, I have two uh, other channels besides this channel where I upload more Battlefield content, so in case you want to see more content, be sure to check out those channels. I got a shorts channel where which I upload highlights, funny moments, uh, all in short clips, and then I have a gameplay channel where I upload full, raw, unedited gameplay. Uh, so if you want to see more content, be sure to check out my other channels as well. <laughs> 